Sarah, new calls this evening for the Biden administration to grant Ukrainian citizens working or studying here in the U.S. temporary protected status. That would allow them to stay here until they're able to go back home safely. KPI X5's Len Ramirez caught up with one Ukrainian student at San Jose State who was trying to finish her studies when war broke out. Well, like many Ukrainian citizens in the U.S. right now on temporary visas, the student we spoke with today is concerned about her own status, but her main fears right now are for her family back home. Valeria Karnoukova is a Ukrainian citizen studying for a master's degree at San Jose State University, but concentration on her studies has been interrupted by war and fears for the safety of her grandparents, cousins and friends in and around Kiev who are all under Russian attack. It's a very hard time, very hard days for all of them, for me as well. My heart is with them. I'm physically here, but my heart is with them. And we are talking all the time, 24 for 7. Valeria is mostly communicating Communicating through text messages on her phone. She says her relatives are taking shelter in the subways, but they can't sleep because of all the shelling. They were hearing the bombs, the bombarding, uh, and uh, they were very scary. There's not, no way to describe how scary it really is. Santa Clara County Supervisor Otto Lee ought to know. As a Navy reservist, he deployed to Iraq in 2009 and survived the same kind of artillery attacks Ukrainians are experiencing now. But when they get it's close to you when you hear it coming in really loud uh, you knew that you're in the kill zone there's, there's no way to escape you know it's really like is this your is this your unlucky day Lee joins with Ukrainians in denouncing the invasion and this type of raw barbaric act is something that we definitely uh, need to condemn Valeria said she is thankful to America for supporting her country and wants that support to continue as the Ukrainians fight for their own country Ukrainian spirit is very hard to break uh, because we are a strong nation. In San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.